it is a picture of a peacock. I bought this from Amazon and it took nearly two days to deliver. It looks really good and it's a pretty big picture. It also consists of small tiny resin drills. They come in most colors, blue, orange, pink. But then I got mostly blue on the set because the picture is of a peacock. The resin drills are so small that compared to my finger, they are very, very, very tiny. They are just 2.8 mm in diameter. We also get some golden teardrop shaped gems to put on the feathers of the peacock. The set also includes two tool kits that consists of drill pens. These drill pens come in a variety of sizes. They can go up to a maximum of 11 drills per time. But in this set, I've only got 3 drills per time. We can fill these drill pens with wax to make them stickier so they can hold the resin drills and red wax. These pieces of red wax can come in a variety of sizes but the one I've got measures precisely 2cm by 3.8cm. The set also comes with green trays with special grooves on them so we can arrange the resin drills properly on them so it's easier for us to place them onto the canvas and a couple of baggies for kids. These are the symbols. In these symbols, there are a variety of letters and numbers. You have to match these symbols which are on the canvas with their corresponding numbers. And these numbers will be present on the baggies filled with drills. According to them, you have to place the drills on the canvas. The number 26 is the one I will be starting with. There can be many colors of drills in different types of diamond paintings. In more complicated and bigger paintings, there are more colors of drill. But I am a beginner and I started with a basic peacock painting. This contains 39 colors of drill and one packet for the golden teardrops. So let's start diamond painting. The first step to start off your diamond painting is to fill your drill pen with a whole lot of red wax. To do this, push your pen firmly into the red wax. After this, you should see that the tip is filled with red wax which makes it easier for you to pick up the drills and place them on the canvas. The next step is to lay out your green tray and fill them with the colour that you are going to be starting out with. For me, it is number 26 which is a brilliant shade of blue. After you pour it in, shake it gently so that the drills distribute themselves evenly throughout the tray and it's easier for you to find rows of drills to pick up. This can be used both for single places and for multi places. guys that's all for this video i hope you like it be sure to watch my next video on how i seal and frame my diamond painting and also don't forget to watch the grand reveal of the completed diamond painting which will also be in the next video to watch one of my other videos click up here and to subscribe to my channel click down here thank you for watching and have a nice day